Hello guys, welcome to Becky's Kitchen. Today I'm going to share with you the recipe for mango ice cream. Mango is one of my favorite fruits and making mango ice cream is one of my favorite things. I don't buy mango ice cream. Ever since I learned how to do it, I don't buy. Let me quickly show you how to make mango ice cream at home. I had uh, four mangoes but it was not enough so I bought some uh, chopped mangoes from the supermarket. So what you do is uh, you chop some mangoes in cubes and then you put the mangoes in the blender and then blend. You don't have to add any water. Blend the mangoes into a smooth paste. Once you're done, you put the mango, um, the blended mango in a bowl. Then add a quarter cup of sugar. If you're using tablespoon, four tablespoons of sugar, then mix. After mixing, then you put it on the side. Then you take um, double cream. You can get this uh, cream um, in Zambia. It may be a different brand, but you know that section where they sell yogurts, milk. That's where you can find cream. So you put the cream in the bowl. Then you take a whiskey or hand mixer. Then you start um, whisking or mixing. So you have to continue um whisking the cream so the cream is going to change like it's going to become thick and creamy and that's what you want so this is how it should be very nice and creamy yes so once the the cream looks like this that's it you have to stop whisking because if you continue it will turn into like it will be watery you don't want that yeah so that's it And then you take the blended mango, you mix it with the cream. So what I did, I put, um, I was putting bit by bit. I didn't want to put everything in one go. Yeah. So after I mix, 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 I taste how sweet uh, it is. If it's not very sweet, then you add more. It depends. If you like very sweet things, you can... You can add a bit more sugar or it's up to you. But yeah. Then mix, mix, mix. So when you're mixing, just use a spatula or a cooking stick. You don't have to use a whiskey anymore. So once, uh, um, after mixing, then you pour, um, the mango ice cream so it's already ice cream <laughs> yes you pour it in a bowl or any container that you have for ice cream or you can use a you know a baking tin you know that uh, bread baking tin you can freeze your ice cream in those kind of tins yeah so i had some um and then you can use a spatula just to level the ice cream then I had uh, a bit of um, mango, blended mango. Then I just put that on top. Then I used, uh, you know, those um, meat stick. I just used that to mix. <laughs> yeah. You can put the ice cream in the freezer for four hours, four to six hours, or you can do it overnight. I made it at night, so I left it in the freezer for overnight. Then I was trying to use a big ice cream scoop, but it was too big. So I, I got a smaller one. So I was just trying to scoop some ice cream. I really enjoyed making mango ice cream. The good thing about making ice cream at home is that you know what you're putting in your ice cream. So that's it guys. Thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate your love and support. Bye bye.